So what I want to talk about today are preemptive options, right? And we've got a lot of those. It's really going to be situationally based. So if he's a threat to me, my option might be to hit him first, right? Now, I'd like to have other tools besides just a hammer uh, to deal with that threat, or else everything kind of starts looking like a nail and I need to hit him. So there might be a situation where it's not appropriate to hit this person. It might be better for me not to hit this person. And again, it's on me to decide whether or not this is the, the, the correct uh, thing to do. So uh, let's, let's do that real quick. So let's say, for example, he's, he's kind of being a threat. My hands are up, and you notice I already get into a fight stance, and my hands are up, and I try to de-escalate as well as I can. So I'll do a little bit of verbal judo. I'll tell him, hey, listen, man, chill out. Once I realize this is not going to de-escalate, and I need to go, one thing that I can do from here is just turn in here and choke and finish, right? Now, the way that we do that, the way we set that up is, 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 uh, is like this. What I'm going to do for my hands being up here, I'm going to push. And it's more than a push, it's a smack. So I'm smacking here and pulling here. So this is the first phase of it. Second thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to drive this arm through as I walk, and I'm going to clamp here on the shoulder. Now, with this free hand, I'm either going to push the back or I'm going to break here, and I'm going to keep pulling back, let him hang himself, and finally I secure it and finish. I can also finish with the gable grip. So here, break him down. I can grab this gable grip and here. Another thing that we can do, somebody that's actually touching or pushing, so off of this type of a thing, somebody's doing this, I could back out, try to de-escalate, he does it again, I can arm drag and do the exact same thing. So again, one more time, here he goes, push right, and here. Just keep breaking him down, that's it. So the nice thing about this is it gives me the option of A, slowing him down, choking him out, or worse. Uh, and at the end of the day, he's, you know, he's not bleeding, his jaw's not broken, and everything's, everything's good.